my crafty loving friends. Welcome to Repurpose My Way. I'm Shelly. Today we're outside because the sun is out and I haven't seen the sun in several days. Uh, and the flowers are blooming, my wildflowers. And my rooster's crowing. They were quiet right up until I got outside. Uh, hopefully he doesn't make this a problem. <laughs> but I have a really cool haul. I just got back from a garage sale and I have all this stuff and I wanted to show you really quickly, hopefully, some of the stuff that I got from there. And I got a few things from Goodwill as well. So I was gonna show you those few things. Okay, and not only a Goodwill, uh, also a, like a thrift store for veterans. Any donations they get, they sell. And then he goes to the veterans. So I wanted to show you, I've got this little table. I think this would be a great riser once it's painted. Uh, and these are all by donation. So I just made a pile and I just donated, I think 15, I think it was $15 for everything. I got this little metal heart with a little hook. I got this cute little house. It's got a little tea light inside and you can turn it on and off and it actually works. So the battery still works, but it's just a little ceramic. I got this thing. This is so cool. It's like a, a cube. And then it's got enjoy and love and live. And it's got the, the ruler marks on it all the way around. It's very cool. It's home. So you can turn it for whatever holiday or whatever you feel that day. Uh, let's see. This was also from the veterans store. It's just a wooden candle holder. Got this from Goodwill. It was $2. The sun's making my eyes water because <laughs> I'm not used to it. I got these really cool uh, ceramic risers. Um, Strawberry Street, they say. I got these for $2. Got two of those. I always can use risers in my booth to just bring things up to another level. You can just take things and, you know, have them up higher and it just works really nice so I got these really cool mugs now I've made friends with several people that have booths at the flea market and one of them does just a beautiful job her name is Karen and she does a beautiful job in creating vignettes and stuff and she has some really cool she does some really cool stuff but I was looking at stuff and I'm thinking she would love these I think she does really cool stuff with birds. Now this is, I don't know, it's like a little chickadee. And then a cardinal. And the little, it looks like a little branch or whatever for the handle. But these are coffee mugs. Um, MWW Market Made in China. But I thought these were unique unique little coffee mugs. I got four of them. So one side has a cardinal, the other side has the chickadee on it. So you could flip them back and forth. Well, I don't even know if that's chickadee, but a bird. Anyway, kind of a swallow or something. But um, I thought I would get those for her if she wants them. If she doesn't, I'll put them in my booth. I don't care. Uh, but they were just too cute to leave. I couldn't just leave them there. Another thing I've got now, I've seen these before, was, this is from Christmas Tree Shop. Now this was all by donation as well, so I just made a big pile, and they just kept putting stuff in boxes as I got the pile bigger. But this is a rabbit, in like a little rabbit uh, bowl. That's Christmas Tree Shop. But it was just too cute. I could not leave it there. And again, I've seen these in my friend Karen's booth. And I just thought of her. Uh, again, if she doesn't sell, if she doesn't want it, she doesn't want to sell it in her booth, I'll put it in mine. But it's got this cute little bunny lid. And I just love it. Okay. Next tote. This sign I really like. Now hopefully I can do this without getting the glare. It says, bless this home and all who enter. I really just, I love the picture. So I won't do anything with that. I don't know as I'll do anything with it at all. Um, I'm not super thrilled with the um, 
frame, but it's not bad. It's, it's cute. It's almost like a basket weave, but it's not bad. I got this green tablecloth material. It's huge. I just thought it would be really pretty. It's not a Christmassy green or anything like that, but somebody may be interested in something. You know, it's crocheted, I guess. So I just thought it was beautiful. Uh, this lantern, this is probably a working lantern. It still has the wick in it, but somebody turned it into decor and they took uh, ivy and put it around. It's a Beats, D-I-E-T-Z. But it's probably a working lantern. It doesn't look like they've taken anything out of it. But I just liked it. Um, it's black. So, really pretty glass globe. That. I had to pick up this cute little wagon. These are great for right now to put in your booth. The red, and then you could put something uh, in it for um, Fourth of July decor and decorate a little vignette up. I got this pillow as well. It says, God shed his grace on me. And it's got the red and blue and the white. So I thought that was really cute. Um, got some, they didn't have a lot for greenery, but they had a few things and flowers. So I got these two bunches of sunflowers. And one of them just fell on the ground and here comes a chicken. So I thought those were very pretty. They'll look good in something. And then I got this garland also. Oh, that probably goes in this one, but not super long. Let's see, I'm five foot, so five feet. So I thought that was really pretty. Oh, yes, buddy. thought this was a pretty little uh, dishcloth. It says fall flowers, 50 cents. It's got the sunflower. So this fall, I can have a nice theme of sunflowers and stuff. I got this uh, cool decorative tin. Looks like a Hobby Lobby. Probably it doesn't say, but it's like a milk can, metal. And then this is metal as well. It says welcome. It's a little candle holder. And this side's welcome as well. So it's like a punch tin. Don't know where that came from, but that is cute. And then I got this basket as well with the liner in it. It's a little bit dirty, but I think I could take it off and shake it out and, and leave the liner in there. And if somebody wants to buy it. All right. So I also got this sign. It says home sweet home. It's just the um, stitched. It's very country. Um, I got this beautiful little angel, the Nantucket Christmas tree shop, but I just thought she was so pretty for Christmas time. The colors and her, her metal wings. Got this cute basket, nice dark color, so I don't really have to do anything to that. Star with a hanger on it. I bought a green one not too long ago at Goodwill, I think it was. Um, but this one's a black one. It definitely needs cleanup, but very cute. The snowman with the tag still on it. It's like a stack of snowman heads. I love snowmen. Uh, so very cute. It says Crazy Mountain. Crazy Mountain exclusive designs. It's got a little signature there, but it's so cute with all the little hat, the hat and all the little heads. Okay, what else we got here? God shed his grace on me, another little sign. Great for this time of year, 4th of July, summer decor. Um, I got this reindeer. It's like a, I guess it's metal. Very cool. I love the antlers. Um, a star, whoops, star with the 4th of July colors, red, white, and blue. 
So I'll probably pop that in my booth next Thursday. We'll see if some of these things will sell, but it is very close to the 4th of July, so it's hard to say. Uh, I got this, another tablecloth. This one's got chickens on it. Burgundy and kind of an off-white mustardy color. I really liked, really liked the design on that. Thought that would go in my booth good. Um, got a star, blue star, a tin little birdhouse with a little metal roof on it. Very cute. This will go great for th this time of year. Um, I thought these were adorable. Cute little firecrackers for fireworks with the stars and they're all sparkly. Another metal tin with the stars on the front for your candles. It says Americana Today. Made in the USA. That one. Um, oh, I love this enamel tin. This is a black enamel. Got the lid. Doesn't sit very good. <laughs> but I just love that. I, I just couldn't pass that up. So cute. But I got a bell. I got a cloth pumpkin. It's made out of, I think, felt. But it was just cute. It's a little dirty. So I may distress it up and just make it look distressed anyway so that's okay uh love forgive and be thankful little little wood sign made in the usa another uh birdhouse this has got the stars and the stripes and a little door in the back very cute love that another little sign betsy ross making the first flag with stars and stripes but that was really nice with all the little sparkles very pretty sign another sign america a flag i love this pledge of allegiance very nice little flag it's missing the dowel to hold it up but i have i have some of those so that's okay okay also out of that box is this cute little uh, snowman head turns on it actually works his nose lights up i can't remember what lights up but it did work when i picked it up but it came in the box so i thought that was super cute so grab that so we got we're all over the place we've got summer fourth of july winter christmas we've got funky bird houses i love the design of this it's got a hole here on the side this is like tile but it looks all broken and it's got the chicken. I just love this. I think that's so pretty. I don't think I'll do anything to it. I don't know. Watering can with a little flower on the end of it. Thought that would be very pretty. Garden decor. See, now we're into garden decor. Here it's just a little wooden box with a candle in it. I think the candle comes out. I don't know. But I don't I remember. But I have candles that'll go in there. But it's just a little wooden, wooden uh, country primitive decor. A light made from a mason jar. Somebody already cut the hole in the back and added the light inside. So it just needs to be cleaned, wiped out, and dump everything out. The light is already attached in there. Um, so I can just take everything and dump it out and clean out the jar because it looks a little dirty. It smells very nice. But anyway... I thought that was really, up, and it works, the bulb works. I grabbed this basket, always a sucker for these kind of baskets. We've got a little bird. This guy is made from like feather material. I don't really know. Pineapple picture frame with a pineapple in it for my daughter. If she doesn't want it, I'll pop it in my booth. I got pit berries, uh, little rings. I guess there's three of them there. So three little pit berry rings are kind of an off-white color with the rusty stars. This whole shoe box is just full of these uh, plate holders. So I grabbed the whole thing. Because having a booth, this really, uh, these are very helpful. I've got all different sizes. I couldn't pass up this Scentsy Warmer. It has birds all over it and a little bird on top. It's so, so sweet. I just love it. And it is actually Scentsy. So all I got to do is clean out the top. That smells really good. Um, 
and I can put it in my booth for sale. So that's what I got for uh, from the yard sale, from Goodwill, from the veterans place. It benefits the veterans whenever you buy stuff from there. It is quite a travel for me to get there, but if I go every once in a while, I think, um, you know, it's definitely worth it. And I like uh, that, it's, that it helps out the, the veterans. So there we go. That's my haul. I hope I went through it quick enough so I didn't take up all your time. But um, let me know. Did you see something in here that you think was totally great and you're glad that I picked up? Or would you uh, have picked up half of this stuff? <laughs> all right. Thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate it. Have a great day.